Alright, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another episode of Stranded Deep. Uh, oh, hey Carl, good morning. Okay, 6.18. Wow, this guy gets up early. Holy. That's too early for me. Good morning, Steve. Hope you sleep well. Why is he not looking at me? Come on, look over here. It's funnier that way. Okay, well, we'll be checking the forest out for, I don't know, land Steve's that might be trying to kill us. Okay. Today, what do we gotta do? We gotta paddle out, we gotta get to the... I can climb that tree. That's weird. Okay, I can't climb it now. Um... So let's go ahead and get our paddle and our machete and maybe our air tank. That's three things that compass. Ah, uh, that's a lot more things than I wanna bring, because what if we get stuff? I like stuff. Okay, well I think if it's this way, where it's a 285, if I remember correctly, so it's right down there. You can't see it at the daytime, it's much more visible at night, so let's go ahead and paddle out. Should we have brought Steve with us for good luck? No, probably not. Steve's not good luck. He tries to kill us. I've tried to balance the audio a bit. I've clicked the other two episodes and it was kind of hard to hear, so... Wow, it is. Yeah, holy crap. Let's go check it out. Nice. Nice, this was a good one. No. Okay, nothing here. Okay, stay away from that fish. It's disturbing. Nothing shitty, okay. Um, console cabinet, okay. Is there an engine in here? Bucket of sea water. Now, you know what? I'll take it. I'll take it. Let's take a breath of air. Is there anything else? Um, no. No, and over here. Yep. Okay. Let's go back up. Hey, Steve's shadow, or, or Steve's figure. It's clearly visible off in the distance over there. You can see his tail. Okay, well, that wreck wasn't as far out as I thought it would be, which is great because we could just get that right out of the way quickly. We took two or three minutes. And I mean, yeah, I had okay stuff. It could have been a little better. We're gonna go to that island. Oh no! Don't break your legs. Oh, that was. That scared me. Don't break your legs like that. That'd be embarrassing as hell. Okay, we don't need that bucket of seawater. Let's max out our vitals first, and we're gonna need to put some work in on that. Seems that food is. Be more important of the or more low running, I guess, more demanding. You have to eat food more than you have to drink water, which is in fact the opposite. The rule of three is you can go three weeks without food, three days without water, and three minutes without oxygen. I don't know. I know you can go a lot more than that. Three weeks without food, three days without water, probably like 30 minutes without oxygen. I mean, you can survive for up to 30 minutes without oxygen, you're going to have some serious problems, like your brain's going to be deprived of oxygen, you could develop some mental illnesses, but uh, I digress. That one's still bubbling. I need to stuff in it. Don't tempt me. Close. Oh, you can see the smoke. Maybe that could be good for any rescue planes that are flying overhead. Which there aren't. Is Steve floating? Oh my god, Steve learned to fly. I could eat you, but you're just so damn cute. Yo, oh, Steve. Come on, cook faster. Ho ho. That time. Okay, I'm just gonna be cooking this. They're much faster. I don't want to waste the fire. Why did I put so many sticks in the fire? We'll get some more sticks when we come back anyway. It's not a big deal. I'm not wasteful. Says the guy who cut down an entire island to make one stupid house. And then he proceeded to put a shark on top of that house. No, I'm not wasteful at all. What's I gonna say? Oh, right, because I counted down like, come on, cook faster. It was like, that's the thing that you do with the toaster. I don't know if that's just me. I'm sure it's not. But like, you stand in front of the toaster and you're like, three, two, one. Nothing. 
three, two, one. Nothing. Three, two, and it pops. It's like, ah, close enough. Totally called it. That's really cool how the smoke refracts like that. I don't even know if this top one's cooking. It's probably not. Yeah, it really probably isn't. Um, hmm. What do we need? So I guess our end game right now is to kill a great white shark. We've got our air tank. Maybe find a harpoon gun. Okay. That's cooked. They both cooked. Wow, that's... Wow. I really didn't think that would work. That's pretty good. Take a drink. Yes, it didn't even spill. Oh, that's great. Yeah, we're full up. Okay. Now, let's quickly get a hell out of here. So I don't have second thoughts about it. Okay, we've used up a bit of our air tube. Air. Air tank. Okay, let's quickly get out of here. So the trajectory of this island is too... 285. And so if 285 is here, the direction home is going to be about 100. That doesn't make that much sense, actually. Eh, it's going to be around 100. It's going to be 100, but it's going to be around there, so... I mean, I don't... I'm sure we'll come across some wrecks, but... Just deep water diving is so dangerous. Because you're never going to know what you're going to come across. It's probably going to be a big old great white shark, and... I don't want to deal with that. Oh, I feel a shark coming. I feel a shark coming. Some angel angelfish. I only recognize them because they're a poisonous fish in the game, but if you bump into them or come anywhere near them, they go and hit you, and then you're going to get poisoning. Yeah, there's another one. Lionfish. That's what it's called. I want to paddle faster. I don't like this. <laughs> the ocean's so deep and scary, and there's so much undiscovered stuff. There could be anything underneath me right now. Could be a six guild shark, there could be a mega melter, could be a megalodon. Probably not that one, but you know, I'm not ruling anything out. I'm paranoid. Anything could happen. There's a dive over there. There's another lionfish. There are too many lionfish. Why is the ocean so scary? Forget Australia, this is what's trying to kill you. <sighs> There's a dive over there, and I really want to look at it. You know what? You only die once, right? Yeah, we're close to the island, so just be quick then. I didn't hear any sharks, so I don't know. Just be really quick with this. Bandage. Okay, that's great. Go, 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 go. Oh, that was, oh, that was too much for my heart. That's bad for my health. Like, I know there are some scary games like Amnesia, and that's a scary game, don't get me wrong. I'm sure Five Nights at Freddy's, when it was original, and one game, I'm sure it was scary too. Uh, Slender, that was scary. I played that one, actually. I didn't play the other two, but I played that one, and yeah, it was scary. But, like, this game is just so atmospheric. Like, when I was seven, maybe ten, I was in Hawaii. And yeah, that's pretty great. But I was in the water, and then the crew on the ship came on the overhead speaker because it was just a little boat tour that we were taking. Uh, it was my mom, my dad, myself, and my sister, maybe. I think my sister might still have been on the boat. And oh man, come on, give me this thing, give me the thing. Where is it? I, I want to know what it is. Screw it. And I was on a little. A little boat that had kind of a glass compartment on it. It's just a small thing that you tow kids around on, I guess. And um, then the PA, the people on the uh, PA came on the overhead and said, there's a shark in the area. Uh, but it's nothing to be afraid of because it's just a little black tip reef shark or something in there. Completely harmless and they don't attack humans, they don't try to hurt humans or nothing like that. So our island should be that one. Okay, um, 
and I really wanted to get back on the boat. Like, I, I wanted to get the hell up out of there like that. It was too much for me. But my parents thought it was nothing, so... <sighs> we stayed in the water, and I'm terrified of sharks now. I blame that experience. There's nothing here. So... Who knows? Well, we'll get some potatoes. I'm sure we're hungry now. Eh, but... We'll take two potatoes and then... No, we'll take three. Gotta have three potatoes, like... Two potatoes aren't enough, and four potatoes is just too much. You know, three potatoes it is. Let's take some sticks and some rocks. The lashings regrow, so I'm not worried about those. They're a renewable resource, but... The sticks and the rocks, what you gonna need? I guess we can find eight sticks in the ground. That'd be ideal. And then we can find four rocks. And then if we need to make any improvements to our house, we can start scavenging and then I'll go for there. No stick. Oh, we got five. I think there was one over here, too. No, apparently not. I'm gonna go around the island quickly and just check for any other chests that might be here. Nothing here. And there doesn't appear to be anything over here. So, one, two, three, four. And there's a dive over there, actually. You know what? I think we're going to go for that one. Yeah. And uh, we're going to take the raft. We're going to take the raft. Because if we get ambushed, I want some land to stand on. And then I guess after that, we'll end that episode. We'll, we'll, we'll go back to our other episode. I'm going to have to cut it out. But, uh,. I don't want to make it over 20 minutes. I'm not sure how long it's running right now. I think we're at... Um, yeah, we should be around 15 minute mark. Yeah, that sounds about right. So there's bubbles over there. And I'm going to assume that we're going to get at least two unique things. So they're going to take up their own two inventory slots. So I'm going to drop the sticks all over there. We'll keep the bandages just in case we get into a shark and get some nibble on us. And I'm hoping that's not going to happen, but uh, you never know. So, we've got our bubbles here. And there's no sharks, so. Awesome! It's an actual boat. Okay. Let's get the. Uh, no. Ah, no, I bumped. Oh, that sneaky little sea urchin. Okay, you know what? You know what? You know what? I'm... That sea urchin is a ninja. I'm not even mad about it. I'm a little mad, but I'm not that mad. Okay, it's not worth using your tail. Look at our arm now. That's disgusting. You stupid sea urchin. Did I take out any of our health? No, I didn't, but... Ew. Ew. That's gross. Binoculars! Hey, okay, okay. Lantern! Oh, yes! A flare gun? Do I have to do something? I don't. I don't. Okay. I'm gonna take it and roll. Uh, no, no, no. Don't make those noises, please. No, no, no. Okay, that's, that's scary. I know there's stuff in there. I need the stuff in there. There's a window over there. Can I get into that window? I can't get in that window. It's a, there's a thing right there. Can't get in that. We can't get in that. And we can't get up here. Oh man, there's a locker in there. There could be anything in that locker. Just imagine the possibilities. Damn. Um, you okay there, buddy? Is he gonna, is he gonna throw up? What's happening? Okay, that seems to have stopped it. That's good. It's getting late. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No, 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 no. You're not turning the night while I'm still that way from home. No, no, no. I, I don't. I, I, I don't allow it. I'm not allowing this. No, I, I just. I'm not allowing this. 
This isn't happening. It's not going to turn to nighttime when we're not at home. That's just, that's more than I can handle. That's more than I can physically handle. We're going, we're going really quickly. Which one's our island? It's that one. Okay. Yeah, man, now we got to find antibiotics or something. Can we just pee on our arm? That's disgusting, I know, but like... If it works, it's if, if it's stupid, and it works, it's not stupid. Well, that's a fish. This is very nice water. Yeah, this is very nice water. And we haven't run into any sharks. That being said, I probably just jinxed it, and I give it about three seconds. But we've been pretty lucky thus thus far. And, um, I think that's our island. If it's not our island, that's going to be bad. And what time is it? Okay, it's 17 o'clock. That's 5. So we got, like, a bit of time. And then we'll just go home, eat some food. And, um, um, I don't think time's going to heal that arm, so. Oh, man, that stupid ninja sea urchin. Wow, it's, it actually scared me a little bit. I'm not going to lie. I, I got scared by a plant. I don't, it, no, it's not a plant, is it? It might be. No, it's not. It's not. It's a plant animal. It's like a sea cucumber. Maybe that's a plant. I might be wrong on this. That might be a plant. And that might not be our island. If that's not our island, I'm, I'm going to cry. A lot. What happens if we never see Carl again? Or Steve? That doesn't look like our island. Oh dear. That doesn't look like our island at all. Oh no. That doesn't look like our island. Does it? Oh, maybe. I think that's our island. I think it is. I think it is. If it wasn't our island, there'd be no trees around it. There'd be more trees around it, I mean. Frame rates dropped. Sunset is coming. Clearly. I think that's... Yeah, that's our island. Oh, thank god. And Steve didn't even despawn. Wow, this, this went out. This worked out pretty well. Minus our arm. Minus our disgusting deformed arm. It worked out pretty good. Okay. Well, that was an adventure and a half hour. We didn't run any sharks, which I'm glad about. I'm glad, I'm glad about it. Yeah, okay. Let's go throw our stuff down. I think I'll organize in between this episode and that. Ah, oh, we saw our campfire going. A flare gun. That's amazing. A lantern. That's going to be great atmosphere for our house. I'm going to put it right there. I'm going to set it up. I'm going to set it up. This freaking lantern. Steve all over. Okay, it's an upside down lantern. We got two binoculars. I do not know. Okay, that's useless. Wow, that, that's really bad. <laughs> we got a bandage. Not gonna do much for us right now. We got an air tube, tank. Made that mistake twice now. Machetes and our compass, and then we're gonna cook some crab on that. I'm not surprised our fire's still going, honestly. Kinda weird. I wouldn't have expected it, but you know. If it's just gonna be efficient for us, that's gonna be great. So, our vitals aren't actually that bad. Three coconuts should just about do it. And that crab. We're gonna treat ourselves. We've earned it. None of them break? Wow, we have a bad throwing arm on it. Okay, never mind. I take it all the way back. The crab's done. Yay! Oh, okay. Yep, yep, way to go. I found it! And finally...
satellite camp over here. And we'll find that coconut eventually, but right now let's eat up and get fed. Can you bring it over on top of the house? Ready to go. Whoa, what the hell is... It's got some weird textures on it. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna go to bed. It's late. Hi, hey, Carl. I had a rough day. Well, thanks for watching. If you liked the episode, like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you in the next episode of Stream the Deep. Thanks for watching. Peace.